Hey guys, Zephyrnix here. I will make a quick video really fast. It's not going to be quick. You know how it is. Uh, regarding Mr. John Castro. Now, Mr. Corey Toronto actually said that I actually did not um, go over his points. So, I I'll go over a couple of John Castro's points. Um, basically, long story short, I watched this video again. And uh, basically, he thinks that Salah Revenant Presidor are was scared of him because they encountered him. Um, anyone who believes that, raise your hand. Uh, the reality of it is, dog, they don't care about you enough to do that. Dude, you have like three subs. Why the fuck would someone want to make a response to you? This is actually a gift. This is a gift. What I'm doing for you right now, this is a pure gift. And I'll explain to you why the gift is in a minute. Uh, he mentioned how he go went again against uh, Elvo Dumars and made Elvo Dumars take out his video or whatever. Somehow I doubt that. I really do. But then again, let me put it this way. I know who Elvo Dumars is still. I mean, I don't know who FL Dumars is. Who are you? People still don't know you. In fact, I want you to Google your name, Original Dogman. And it says, and I quote, Who is Original Dogman? No, seriously, who the fuck is he? It says that. And that exactly how it says it. It's, you know, it's like, wow. How do you get owned? How do you get owned by the biggest search engine in America? In the world, actually. Speaking of that, he also mentioned how I had to watch his video in order to know his real name, and that's how you know that's how I know you watch it, and that's how I flagged it, whatever. Here's the problem with that, buddy. Once again, Google Original Dogman. What is the first thing that you get? John Castro, aka Original Dogman. It says that. That's one. Two. Go to your videos, your own videos, and look under the video at the bottom. No, excuse me, the for one of your first videos with the guns. It says, "Hey, this is your boy, Original Dogman, um, John Castro." Wow, dude. Are you serious? Then I noticed also that he also, um, I mentioned how he flagged himself and he gave off a fake laugh, but then never denied it. He never actually, in that whole video, he never denied that he actually made his own, um, he actually, um, flagged himself, but with other accounts, of course, that he made. But we'll get into that in a minute. So, um, he also goes ahead and talks about how he has a job placed in three and videos, and he makes videos, and why would he make multiple accounts? Then. Turns around, not even three seconds later, count it, three seconds later, and talks about all the accounts that he made. He made like he talked about like four accounts that he actually made, multiple accounts, if you will. Then he goes ahead and starts to lie to us by saying he blocked those accounts. How do you block those accounts if those accounts are inactive? You said those accounts are inactive, yet you're saying that you blocked them. How do you do that? How do you block an active account? Here's a, here's a, here's here's the answer. You don't. You can't. You're lying. Speaking of lying, he also declared to someone else in another uh, video that I actually PM'd him with my old account. So I, I challenge you, uh, Castro, to go ahead and show us that PM. We'll wait. By the way, for the record, my accounts are as follows. Zephyrnix. Zephyrnix Eternal. Ligo Washington. And uh, Silvernix. Now, granted, my memory's not that good. So by chance, if I did, go ahead. Prove me wrong. But I'm pretty sure I would not have taken the time out to PM you. Something tells me that. And if I did, it was a long time ago. But I'm pretty sure I didn't. But go ahead. I challenge you. Just one. Just just, just at 1 PM. Show me eight if you got but one. Um, What else? Um, Oh, biggest thing. He goes ahead and tells like, and he talks about this like his lifetime achievement award about all the people who he quote unquote owned on um YouTube. YouTube, dude, are you serious? Do you have that ridiculous of a life? Like, like that retarded of a life that your life like means so little that YouTube is your only access to a decent life? Are you serious? Is your Walmart job that bad? You, that, that is the most retarded thing I've ever heard in my life to the point where you think that YouTube is like a lifetime achievement award right there. Like, he talked about it like he won like the Nobel Peace Prize. I'm like, are you serious? Like, even my, my wife had to stop and turn around. She said, who the fuck are you listening to? Talking like that. And I'm like, I had to show her. Now, she knows him as um, the guy who can't do math. You know? So, hey, I guess, and essentially, you are getting, uh, you're becoming a celebrity, dude. My wife knows you now. She knows you as the guy who um who thinks that 20 to, um 20 minus 0 equals 0. So, yeah, good job, buddy. Um what else? Speaking of which, he declared that that is his goal in life. His goal is to get subs. That is his his his, his achievement. After
after that, his programming will be complete and he will self-destruct. So by all means, please, everyone, sub John Castro immediately. Original Dogman, sub him. So he can go ahead and self-destruct. Go ahead, sub him right now. Sub him. Go ahead, do it. Matter of fact, everyone make fake accounts like he does and sub. Dude, check this out. First of all, he also des described how um, if, if I make a response to him and he makes a response to me, he gets the subs that I get, thus he is winning. First of all, I didn't realize this was a competition. But, okay, let's go ahead and put this in perspective, okay? First of all, just because someone um, makes a response to you, does not necessarily mean that they're going to sub to you. Okay? I know I personally don't sub to people just because you made a response. And to anyone, really. Now, that's one. Two, I don't care, dude. I really don't. Subs are not important to me. My subs the, as people are important to me, but actually getting subs? No, that's not important to me. If that was the case, I'd be a PlayStation fanboy making PlayStation fanboy videos. But, here's a problem with, like I said, here's another problem with what you say. In order for you, your, your plan to work, here's two things that has to happen. One, I would have to make a video response to you. And if you notice, I've never made a video response to you. All my um, videos have been responses, but not a, a, a real, real video response. It's always been just a video. That's one. You can check for yourself. Has it's not a response. Two. In order for your videos, the ones you send to me, to actually register as a response, and actually for you to get the notoriety and the the uh, no the, the the notoriety of my name, you would actually have to spell my name right. So essentially, what's been going on is that you've been owning yourself the entire time because you're too stupid to realize how YouTube works. You've been trying to like work the system of YouTube since that is your only means of survival, apparently. Um, and you don't even know how to um, pick up the fork. Dude, that's really bad. It's not that hard. Um, I think I've made my point in terms of uh, his, you know, I've done it. I've pretty much went across most of his, um, most of his points right there and pretty much threw them threw away. But I want to go crap. Now, this one goes out to General G and um, all those people who actually have been flagged. The real people who have been flagged. Now, I've actually been thinking about this for some time. Has anyone realized that all you guys who've been being flagged have had a situation with John Castro in the past? Have you realized that? Have you realized that everyone who has been being flagged lately, who has been flagged, has had a battle with John Castro? I found your flagger, guys. It's John Castro. He flagged himself and he's been flagging you guys with his fake accounts. That is what's going on. You guys have a good night. I thought I'd just lay that little bit of wisdom on you.